Hi, this is Mike, and uh, today I want to show you one of the new features in Blackboard 9, which is the home page. Uh, the home page is going to allow your students and you to see stuff um, pretty quickly and easily um, on your Blackboard site. Um, the first thing that I want to point out is that I'm looking at this in edit mode. I could toggle it between edit mode and edit mode off so that I could see what my students see and what um, I as a faculty member see. So up at the top right hand side I'll just click on the edit mode um, button and I'll turn edit mode off and I'll see that this is what my students are going to see. They won't have all the options to edit things or change things around. Um, but you notice I have my announcements here and a what's new area here and I'll click on my edit mode on so I can start making changes to that. Okay, so let's start up from the top. I've got my home page and I've got a little chevron here. In Blackboard 9, any time that you see a little chevron um, next to a word or some text, you'll be able to click on the chevron and it'll give you some options. So these are the home page options. I can either edit the home page or I can change the page banner. Um, I'm going to go ahead and click on edit home page and it's going to allow me to change the name of the home page and I can change that to just home if I like. Oops. Sorry about that. Okay, so I've changed that to home and I can change it to whatever I like. I can also allow my students to personalize the page for themselves if they like. Um, they can just basically change the colors and things like that. Um, but it'll only be for them, it won't be for the whole class. I can also change the options so I can make it available to users um, or not available. Um, also I can make it available to guests or observers. So I'll go ahead and hit submit. And you see that I've changed the name of that home page um, on the page itself. If you notice in the course menu area, home page is still listed as home page. And I can show you how to change both of those simultaneously in another lesson. Alright, so that's the um, edit page. Now I can also add a banner um, to this page. So I'm going to click on that chevron again and I'm going to change the page banner. I'll click on page banner and it will bring me a, to a new edit page that will show me sort of a visual editor and I can add any sort of text or images I'd like to this visual editor um, to create a new page banner. So I'm going to go ahead and click on my little add image icon and that's going to be the one directly, it's going to be on the bottom row of icons um, it's going to be the one second to the left next to the paper with the paper clip on it. So that's going to be add image. I'm going to click on add image, insert image, and I've got an image which is just a text file that I've created. And I'm going to go ahead and add that and I'll hit submit. And if you'll notice that this page doesn't open up all the way in some browsers. I'm just going to click and drag and I see that submit button. I'll click on submit and I've got my image which is just text announcing that this is my Blackboard 9 sample class and I'm going to delete that home text because I don't want that as well as my banner. And that's basically it. I can add links if I like, I can add um, URLs, but that's all I want right now and I'm going to click on submit. And that's it. I've got my new banner up on top of my, my um, home page. Okay, and in the next lesson, I'm going to show you how to customize the rest of your home page.